Hi. And uh, this is a brief tutorial I just created earlier on. I know I have this in the Microsoft Office, but the different in this TikTok 2 game is uh, the background image that I've now included. So I just feel I should share it with you guys. And the funny background image included. You can see that there. And uh, how I go about creating this uh, image right actually is uh, using Word, which I can just open for you guys to see. So let's open uh, let's open up the paint shape right there. You can see the size of my paint right there. I set it to 200. Let me let me just reduce it so that you can see the size. That's the size right there. It's 200 by. 160 so I just sort of like painted anything on it and uh, if you then look at the size of my the size of the buttons you would notice the size is also 200 by 160 so the next thing was go to project and I uploaded the the funny images that I drew that's how I managed to develop this. So you then see that's uh, so like that. That hey, you win. You can see we now have a value right there. So that's how you develop a simple tic tac tool. So the, what I'll do next is just to show you guys the code, straightforward. Apart from uh, you, we have to. You will have to declare a variable. This variable declare is uh, a boolean. The data type is boolean, and that's it right there. So if q equals false, then I've added x. The x you won't see, but uh, you will see the resources, which is where I have my image right there. That is this right there. Can you guys see the image that I uploaded? There they are. Okay. The image will pop up when you click on any of the button. It's either this image or this very image right here. If this image pop up, the value of the Q becomes true. If this one pop up, the value becomes false. That's just it. So all you just need to do is copy this very line of code, paste it in every other button. But you notice I also called my checker right there. Because I have a function declare right here. That's a checker function. This function checks to see what values are inside each of the buttons. So if these values are correct, then the system will tell you you've won. And that's all there is to it. So let me just scroll down so that you guys can see the codes. So that's it right there. See that? And that is it. And I guess you all enjoyed this brief tutorial. I don't want it to be too long. I know there's a lot of TikTok too out there, but this one is sort of like straightforward and easy to understand okay that's the code there isn't much different you can see where I've incremented my numbers there and that is it so let me run the program again have a nice day now. Bye for now.